Maximize storage using the custom schedule. Select operating hours, recording modes, and filters to create a separate schedule for each camera for weekdays, weekends, and holidays. Start by selecting the Setup button. Then choose the Schedule button. This opens the mode screen. From here you can choose Regular, Custom, or Single Camera Mode. Under Custom Mode, you can include and define Weekends and Holidays, which will appear as tabs at the top. Let's create a custom schedule for a weekend camera. First, choose the Time tab to define your weekend interval. Use the pull-down menus to choose the first and last day of your weekend. We'll choose Sunday as the first full day and Monday as the last full day of our weekend. You can also include part of the day before and after your weekend to closer simulate your work week. Next, choose the Weekend tab. At the top, you will see three buttons that relate to the Record mode. Active, Alarm, and Disabled. The default is active until you make a change. Notice the 24-hour day is displayed in half-hour increments to the right of each camera. You can schedule various camera record settings in this area. Let's set camera 1 to record only on motion detection from midnight to 6 a.m., to record normally until 6 p.m., and then switch to record on motion detection from 6 p.m. to midnight. Start by selecting the alarm button at the top. Now start at hour 0 next to camera 1. Click, hold, and drag the mouse to the right until the 6 a.m. hour, then release. This segment turns blue, indicating an alarm schedule. Let's configure this alarm by selecting the Setup button on the top left, or by double-clicking the segment. First, we configure the pre-alarm settings. Pre-alarm video is buffered in the system and may be copied to the database once an alarm is triggered. Pre-alarm quality is related to video compression. Let's leave it as normal. Let's set the sensitivity, which decides if video change is strong enough to start pre-alarm buffering, to normal. Down at the bottom, you can select the resolution for your pre-alarm recording. High resolution 4SIF pre-alarm is only available on Intel XIP and Ultra platforms. Set the pre-alarm duration to record up to 5 minutes of video previous to an alarm trigger. Let's choose 15 seconds. Up on the right, use the pull-down menu to set your live alarm filter. We want to record when motion is detected. Select Setup to configure alarm. Now, inside the image, click your mouse to create a series of connecting lines, creating a grid that will define the area detecting motion. With motion alarms, you can have more than one grid per camera. The sensitivity setting determines minimum video change required to trigger an alarm. Let's leave this in the middle. Select Apply. Select OK to save the settings. Now, from midnight to 6 a.m. on weekend days, this camera will only record if the motion detection filter is triggered. This setup saves storage space because only specific conditions trigger recording. To finish our example for camera 1, we need to create a second segment from 18 or 6 p.m. to 24 or midnight. Since we want to use the same filter settings as the previous alarm segment, we can right-click on our first blue segment and choose Copy. Now right-click on the second segment and choose Paste. It's that easy. We can now apply Camera 1's record schedule to other cameras by selecting Camera 1's title and dragging it to any camera you want to have the same weekend record schedule, although manual live filter adjustment is required.